Okay, good morning everybody. Uh, as you can see, I took the old controller off. I mean, it's still hang on, hanging. Uh, and here's the new controller. But, for some reason, this connection, which goes, I believe, to the battery, is not present on the new controller. Which has, has me baffled. And uh, here's the, another extension wire that goes to the controller. Um, I have no idea what's going on. This is now taking this apart was no easy task, but it's doable. Um, you just gotta get away all that silicone to get uh, these little connectors off and everything's pretty much plug and play at this point but uh yeah as I was going around to all the other wires you know snipping the zip ties and whatnot and getting everything ready uh I can't because apparently this lead goes to here I believe I don't know but it's two different types of connections, and I'm sorry to say that's beyond my wheelhouse. And I don't feel comfortable doing that, so I don't know what to do next, or what the next step is, because, I don't know, I'm, I thought I'd get this up and running and have it by, you know, the weekend. But I don't know. I really don't know. I mean... It's a great bike, except all the problems I'm having with it, obviously. But, uh, yeah. I mean, it was. Oh, look at that. That's. Yeah, that's everything. I had to take that off to get access to that. So now I guess it's going to be stuck on my bike rack until I figure out what else to do, because. I don't know. I don't know. I'm lost. Uh, I'm going to send this to, to Kyle and Jessica and see what they got to say, because, I mean, it, I believe it's the same same model. Let's take a look. I can get... Yeah, that's... That's the new one. And here's the one that's on the bike. Yeah, same one. All right. I guess I'll talk to you guys later.